Put drivers behind the line. Three, two, one, go. That's more like it. Starting in off in the autonomous time. Judgment call has its cube fall into its electronics. That may be a problem going forward. Both teams were able to score three points coming out of the autonomous. That means each team had one robot move out of the community area. For the Blue Alliance, Swift and the Bonneville bots are each picking up game pieces. While the Robo Hawks look to play defense and to keep Red Alliance from being able to move around freely on the field and to pick up their pieces. For the Red Alliance, the Julian operators are shaking into position. Meanwhile, Judgment Call is looking to get its pieces out. It's a bit dicey having two cubes sitting right together because you can only control one game piece at a time. The Robohawks finally nudged that cube into the bottom row of the scoring grid and then immediately run onto the charge station for the, blue, for the Red Lions. Judgment call and the underdogs look to do synchronized charge station climbing. Well choreographed, but Will it ultimately will be useful? The Blue Alliance manages to pull there. It's a Blue Alliance victory, 51-45, a very close match. The penalty points make a difference. Members of the Blue Alliance for this match will receive three ranking points, two for the victory and one